You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Sure, well, we'll rescue Sean and then we'll get ourselves lost, good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. Oh, you got a nice looking horse. Find the boat. All right, boys, follow me. Let's head up river and find this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols right. out all over this area. Yes, south of the river, West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. I keep mm. hearing about this woman, Heidi McCourt. Some young mother, they're saying, Dutch murdered on the boat. Oh. Uh, I don't know about that. I wasn't there. Bad day. And no money yet, it seems. I hope you're gonna go down and around. Dutch and Jose say they do, but it's trapped in the town. Oh, we're close. <laughs> oh, it must be wonderful to have such trust in one's parents. Mine would have sold me for a hog's head of ale. In fact, I think they tried. <laughs> that sucks, but explains you a lot. There, look. I think that's our boat. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. Keep your guns away until we know it's Sean, okay? I know what you two are like. You think they can see us? Hey, Trelawney, if yell can, louder. Just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. But without me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Maybe. <laughs> anyway, we should keep it down. Come on, let's keep them in sight. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, <laughs> dear boy. Very cute. Push up, come on! Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. It's a good guess. your binoculars out. Let's see what we're dealing with here. Yeah, we got something going on there. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Axe Skeleton's boys, but I hear they're a big crew, wild, built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. There's hey, Joe. Charles! What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Okay. All 
Alright, so, um, we finally figured out how to rescue Sean. I just needed to be craftier about it. Instead of just riding into town like a moron. Javi, you're visible, bro. Quietly, if we can. Leave it to me, yeah. gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. You want us to teabag them? Take out your knife. Step here. Let's get in the river. Okay. I'm following you, Javi. Here. Thought you said to wait. Gentlemen, excuse me, dear brothers. My wife is taken ill, gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. You she take the one on the left. Where is she? Okay, come on. Stay low. I, I'm beside myself. I, if I lose, if I lose Bessie, I lose everything. Oh, calm down, Mister. I, I can't. I can't. I, I'm having. He a didn't see that. <laughs> You can get up, bro. Javi, stop playing with him and kill him. Okay. Let's get after him. A pleasure as always, gentlemen. I think you have it from here. Wait for me, Javi. Come on. We got two halfway up the canyon to deal with. Hmm. I see him, but it's actually three, Javi. Alright. Who's the guy you got him from? Is he alive still? Come on, focus. Oh. Focus, okay. We're gonna have to shoot our way up Okay. Watch him, Hobby. Javi. Yep, I see him. Woo! Took out that ankle. What do you think about that? I got you, Charles! Reload this shit. Two more, look out! Here's Charles! All good? Wouldn't go there. Hey, bud! The camp's up this way. Woo! Come on! My men's! Alright, let's go. Army don't bother me. Still time. You're done for the Mister. 
Which cabin? Oh, that cabin. Shit. That sucks. Damn, dude, just die. It'd be a lot easier if you did. Ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Thanks, Sean. I enjoy the backhanded compliments. Hold, Arthur. A warm embrace I mean... for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, <laughs> nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot at Charles Adams' stomach. <laughs> I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. You're a great man, aren't you, Morgan? The kind of young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split <laughs> up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? That's right, boys. I'm going to see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Okay, come on. <laughs> Have I got stories for you? Yeah. I can't wait. <laughs> I imagine you all miss me a lot. But fear not, the joy's back in your lives now. <laughs> I like him. He's a good one. All right, let's see. We got some gin here. We'll go ahead and take some of that. Um, I think we're going to... Ooh, Tots, you startled me. Let's check the cabins and stuff first. Because I feel like that's where most of the stuff is going to be at. Like the really important stuff, you know? Yeah, my wife will. But we gotta be quick. I feel like I, I think... Oh, really? Okay. Is there a window? Oh, shit. They're investigating the area. Okay, we gotta go. Okay, then, girl. I don't know who it was. They just know that they need to investigate. Alright, now I presume we can head on back uh, to camp, and that should probably open up some other stuff for us. That's what I'm thinking, anyway. Alright, we got away oh, with that yes. real clean, like, ah, uh, pretty good, considering. So, that might actually start opening up fairly soon. What's this? Something, okay, John needs to speak to you. Pouring forth oil. Hmm. All right, well, we're out that way anyway. Let's go. What do we got? Ha! That was good. What? I just don't understand this at all. Hey, over here! Yeah. 
What's up? That was a very Mexican sounding strumming Senor, of strings. Spanish? What's the of problem? course! Problem? No, there's no problem. Quite the contrary. No problem? Well, there is a Are problem. Are you sure? For me, but not for mm. you. All right. <laughs> I ain't got time for No, this. Well, no, wait! Give me a minute of your life. I might just change it forever. I'm sure you will have heard of me. Maximo like that hat. Cristobal Valdespino, the renowned explorer. Well, unless you're related to Pedro there Pascal. I don't know yet. About me. I once had high tea with the Viceroy of India. I helped liberate South America. I've climbed mountains and swum across seas. I have had... Interesting. Many women. Okay. I've spent the last three months hunting treasure on the American frontier. Beautiful country. Reminds me a lot of Almeria. But tomorrow I set sail for the island of Shikoku in the Japanese archipelago in search of the legendary Tokushima Sapphire. Mm. Well, mm. good for you. No, no, hold on. You see this map here? It was made by the Japanese yes. gang. They robbed banks all the way from here to California. Yeah, I know who the Jack Hall gang are. Oh, them you have heard of, but me? Huh. Well, uh, rumor huh, has it indeed. they buried gold somewhere in this area, but were killed before they could retrieve it. They created two maps to ensure it was well hidden. This is the first and should lead you to the second. You just need to follow the landmarks drawn here. Me? Yes! Unfortunately, I am out of time now, but I am prepared to sell it to you for the low price of... <gasps> Ten dollars. A trifling investment for a man such as you, given the potential returns. Look, Maximo. I'll take it. Uh, what the hell? Why not? A very I'm nice flush with cash. I wish you the best of luck. Thanks. Okay, Jack Hall treasure hunting. What do we got? A Mustang? <gasps> oh my god, a Mustang. Are you freaking... Hey, 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 Maximo. Don't be messing with my horses now. No! We might have to get us a Mustang at some point. Dang. Alright, I'm gonna be on the lookout for y'all. No offense, tots. But a Mustang would be real nice. Do you sponsor? Oh, it's you. Sure, but <laughs> perhaps not as much as you. Oh, <laughs> no, no, don't worry about these. Actually, well, take some. Take a couple of packs. Take a few. Oh, thank you. What are all the cigarettes Thanks. for? Are you heading on a long journey or something? <coughs> no, 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 nothing like that at all. I'm just interested in the cards. Okay. Cigarette cards. Oh, you got any? Yeah. Well, get them out. Let me take a look. Come on, come on. A little picture card? Yeah, I'll pay you a good price. Okay. Here. Ah, not that I haven't got. The value is in completing the set. Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day. Just when keep opening the Damn. Box. I wish I could explain to you the pleasure and the pain I get out of collecting these babies. Sure. It's, uh, His, um, uh, he ain't gonna live long. It is. Not to mention the vast amounts of life reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh. And the amount of money. Okay. Oh, a veritable fortune, sir. Fortune? Oh, sure, sure. A complete set of any series is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Over here? Circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. Meow, meow. You want to be getting your desert. ashes and shit all so over those rare. cards? I never knew. Sure. How much? Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. Oh, uh, of course. Yeah. But, you know, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. You'd pay me. Oh, yeah? A fair price. Now, you send them to me right here. Phineas T. Rainbow. At your service. Yeah, I gotta all run. right, Phineas. This is my train. Look me up, okay? Think about this deal. Only a complete set. That's where the value lies. All right, then, Phineas. Off, dude, ain't nobody bothering you. 
All you do is talk. If you really wanted to back that up, he'd have pulled his own gun out. Show me the strap! Instead of running your mouth. I think I ran something over. Hey, listen! I just wanted to say... I know you bastards missed me. <laughs> <laughs> Even you, Arthur. Even you. But... I'm back home now. So everything's going to be okay. Uncle Sean. Yeah, well, I brought food. And don't you worry, Miss Grimshaw, you old crone. <laughs> if I have to whip him, I will. Did you get a bump on the head? And don't you worry, Mr. Pearson, you drunk old shitbag. It'll be nothing. Got himself his own little box. Game in the pot. Now, Deadly Maguire's back. <laughs> and don't worry about nothing, Mrs. Grimshaw. We'll have this camp running like clockwork. I love you, bastard. <laughs> Have fun! Have lots of fun! <laughs> oh, it brought me all the way back here just to do that? Really? That's kind of stupid. Oh? Somebody's happy, for once. The drinks are on me. They always are. <laughs> my band. Hey. Hey. Oh. Okay. Karen and Sean. Who's... A merry song. The wide, oh, it's him. Wide world I wander over with a light, light heart I rove along. Oh, I'm a wild free rover. I sing a merry song. The wide, wide world I wander over with a light, light heart I rove along. Reverend, good lord. With a light, light heart I rove along. The wind roves free your hill and river. And the clouds roam free along the sky. How you doing, John? You getting a little sloppy over there, brother. Goodness. Sean will make your life hell when he finds out you're an Odrisco. Oh, great. <laughs> Let's head to bed, and uh, we'll worry about John in the morning. What was that? Okay, everybody's in my way. Oh, it's Javi. You got a guitar, Javi? Was it a long ride back with him? You have no idea. I can imagine. Oh, with the light, light, hard, I roll along. Damn, y'all is rude. He brought over the real music. Hello there. When I was just Oh, good lord. I'm done. Javi's music was better. Hosea! Hosea! Whoa. You good, bro? 
<laughs> hey. <clears throat> Hosea. How are you keeping all right? Old, man? Uh, you know. Been better. We have had quite the ride, huh? Oh, yeah. Quite the ride. Arthur? Hi. I've been trying to talk to you. They ain't strong yeah, let me yet. back up. <laughs> no. Maybe they never will. They won't. I'm going to get us out of this one. <laughs> we have been stuck before. <laughs> you, <laughs> do you remember that mine? <laughs> of course. Hey, that, oh, that nauseating Poppin' Jay in that frontier town. <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> We're old men, Arthur. Let us live in our memories. Whatever you say, hey. Dutch. <laughs> we did it. Jose. Huh? Whatever else happens, we did it. Everybody else seeing what I'm seeing? <laughs> so no divorce? Yeah? No divorce? Mom and dad? Okay. Hey, no, for real though. Are you I good? Because like... In a good mood. Am I stuck in the past, Arthur? Oh, only you can answer that. <laughs> the girls are having fun. Uh, let's go ahead and sleep till morning. Let's sleep it all off. Dang, I've been recording for like three hours now. Y'all excited for The Mandalorian? I'm recording it the, day, the night before, so... Uh, I'm recording because I don't want to... I'm taking all of tomorrow off and I'm not doing anything else. Examine rambles through woods and plains? What's that? A field guide to the mechanical kingdom. Okay. I don't know who gave me that, but I'll take it. Javi's still over there doing his thing. Good on you, Javi. Sir. Looks how how you doing? Heavy in Blackwater, Dutch. Posters of you and Jose everywhere, Trelawney said. All the more reason to stay well away for now. I got no intention of going back anytime soon. Charles! Oh, Charles! Go hunting with Charles? I would love to, but I kind of don't want to right now, so we're going to ignore Charles for a moment. <laughs> um, let's see. We're looking for John. Good morning. morning. Oh, no, 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 no! I didn't want to do all that. Get out of there. Thank you. All right, so John's got something he wants to say to us, and he's out this way. Johnny, where are you? Where are you, John? Oh, hey, shit, Arthur. I walked right by you. Hey, what do you want? What you got there? What is that? What is it, John? Hello? What do you want? Uncle told me something about a train. <sighs> what did he say? Mary Beth overheard something about a train full of wealthy folk rolling down through Scarlet Meadows just south of State Border. Yes. Oh, okay. Sounds that familiar. I ain't even sure about doing it. Come on. At night, not too guarded, it's perfect. Nah, I ain't thought it through. <laughs> you know, stopping a train, pain in the ass. Sure. But what if we could force a train to stop? <laughs> well, of course. We get a wagon full of something flammable. Oil. Put it on the tracks. They see it. They know they either have to stop or die. Ain't no train driver wants to be cooked alive. That is kind of brilliant. Uh, for you. <laughs> and that's <laughs> a real idea. I think that's the first time you ever had one of them. 
Shut up. You might be the first bastard to ever have half his brains eaten by a wolf and end up more intelligent. So we're doing it? Yeah, we're gonna need That's how you know Arthur loves him. Guns, for real, for real. Real frightening. And some dynamite to open up the train. I'll get the supplies. Gotta head into town for Abigail anyway. Don't even ask. You go find us an oil wagon. Yeah, I know just the place. They're always heading into that refinery. There's an old rundown shack just over the border, north of a place called Dewberry Creek. Leave it hidden somewhere near there. What is that run, John? My goodness. Anyway, that's how you know, uh, see, wagons that can be stolen for John are blipped with that. Okay. Um, Sean. <laughs> Everybody around here is all sloppy today, except for me. Hey, man. I make no apologies for anything I did last night. I'm sure. Uh, yeah, so, I was saying, that's how you know Arthur loves somebody, because he really goes all in on the backhanded compliments and shit. My God, what so I think I that's where we're gonna... Night? I don't care what you did. Ooh, goodness, Karen. Away from what me. the... Little Irish bastard. I love you too, my sweet. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah, so that's where we're going to leave it today. We'll catch up with John and do everything else next time. And I'll see you guys on a later day.